back again. <laughs> At least Amber looks nervous, like, for real. She's a very bad actress, so... Come on. Right, Mr. Fourperson, is this the verdict of the jury? Yeah. All right, is it unanimous? Thank you, sir. Jane? I'm gonna read it now. In civil case number CL 2019-2911, Mr. Depp's claim against Ms. Heard. One, as to the statement appearing in the online op-ed entitled Amber Heard, I spoke up against sexual violence and faced our culture's wrath. That has to change. In the Washington Post online edition, quote, I spoke up against sexual violence and faced our culture's wrath. That has to change, end quote. Do you find that Mr. Depp has proven all the elements of defamation? Answer, yes. Yes! Has Mr. Depp proven by a greater weight of the evidence that question, the statement was made or published by Ms. Hurd? Answer, yes. The question, the statement was about Mr. Depp. Answer, yes. Question, the statement was false. Answer, yes. <laughs> Question, the statement has a defamatory implication about oh Mr. God. Depp. Answer, yes. Question, the, de the defamatory implication was designed and intended by Ms. Hurd. Answer, yes. Oh my God. Question, due to circumstances surrounding the publication of the statement, it conveyed a defamatory impl implication to someone who saw it other than Mr. Depp? Answer, yes. Do you find that Mr. Depp has proven by clear and convincing evidence that Ms. Heard acted with actual malice? Answer, yes. <laughs> Two, as to the statement appearing oh in the op-ed entitled, A Transformative Moment for Women in the Washington Post print edition and the online op-ed Amber Heard, I spoke up against sexual violence and faced our culture's wrath. That has to change. In the Washington Post online edition. Quote, then two years ago, I became a public she looks figure so mad. representing domestic abuse, and I felt the full force of our culture's wrath for I'm like, women. I'm just crying. Am I crying? I don't know. The Do lighting might just Mr. be making it look like I'm crying. But... All the elements of defamation. Answer, yes. Has Mr. Depp proven by a greater weight of the evidence so that question, the statement was made or published by Ms. Hurd? I'm shaking. Answer, yes. Question, the statement was about Mr. Depp. Answer, yes. I can't believe it. Question, the statement was false. Answer, yes. <laughs> question, the they look so a defamatory implication about Mr. Depp. I feel Mr. bad Depp. for Elaine. Answer, yes. Question. The defamatory implication was designed and intended by Ms. Hurd. Answer. Yes. Question. Due to circumstances surrounding the publication of the statement, it conveyed a defamatory implication to someone who saw it other than Mr. Depp. Answer. I yes. fucking believe it. Do you find that Mr. Depp has proven by clear and convincing evidence that Ms. Hurd acted with actual malice? Answer, yes. Three, as to the statement appearing in the op-ed entitled, A Transformative Moment for Women in the Washington Post print edition and the online op-ed, Now I just gotta see if she Hurt, gets her counterclaim. I spoke up against sexual violence and faced our culture's wrath. That has to change. In the Washington Post online edition. Quote, I had the rare vantage point of seeing in real time how institutions protect men accused of abuse, end quote. Do you find that Mr. Depp has proven all the elements of defamation? Answer, yes. Has Mr. Depp proven by a greater weight of the evidence? Oh, there's my friends there. The my local friends that didn't leave because they live there. Answer, Hi, yes. friends. <laughs> Question, the statement was about Mr. Depp. Answer, yes. Question, the statement was false. Answer, yes. Question, the statement has a defamatory implication about Mr. Depp. 
Answer, yes. <laughs> they can't have a reaction. Question. Oh, there's the Nick. The implication was designed and intended by Ms. Hurd. This is weird to Answer. watch when you're not yes. there. Question. Due to circumstances surrounding the publication of this statement, it conveyed a defamatory implication to someone who saw it other than Mr. Depp. Answer, yes. Do you find that Mr. Depp has proven by clear and convincing evidence that Ms. Hurd acted with actual malice? Answer, yes. All right, so. As against Amber Hurd, we the jury award compensatory damages in the amount of $10 million. <laughs> oh, she does not Amber have $10 Heard, million. Dollars. We the jury award punitive damages in the amount of $5 million. 2019 2911. Do you find that Ms. Heard has proven all the elements of defamation? Answer No. <laughs> Two. As to this statement appearing in the April he won both. 2020 online edition of the Daily he Mail. He won both. Quote Quite simply, this was an ambush, a hoax. They set Mr. Depp up by calling the cops. I can't believe you won both. Trick. Do you find that Ms. Heard has proven all the elements of defamation? Answer, yes. Oh. Has Ms. Heard proven oh, by a okay. great weight of the evidence? She wants something. That question, Mr. Waldman, while acting as an agent for Mr. Depp, made or published the statement? Answer, yes. Question, the statement interesting, was about Ms. Interesting, interesting. Answer, Yes. Question. The statement was seen by someone other than Ms. Hurd. Answer. Yes. Question. The statement was false. Answer. Yes. Do you find can't that really Ms. Hurd has though. proven by clear and convincing evidence that the statement by Mr. Waldman was made with actual malice? Answer. Yes. Are my headphones plugged in right Three. now? As to this statement appearing in the April 27th, no. 2020 <laughs> online edition of the Daily Mail, do you find that Ms. Hurd has proven all the elements of defamation? Answer, no. As against John C. Depp II, we, the jury, award compensatory damages in the amount of $2 million. As against John C. Depp II, we, the jury, award punitive damages in the amount of $0. So you only Just have to pay your $2 million. Which to have the jury polled? Yes, Your Honor. All right. Jamie? Members of the jury, if this is your verdict, please answer yes. If this is not your verdict, please answer no. Juror number six. Juror number 10. Yes. Juror number 15. Yes. Juror number 16. Yes. Juror, juror number 22. That lawyer looks happy. Juror number 27. <laughs> I know Ben and Camille can't. Juror number They're 29. trying so hard to be professional, yeah. but. Okay. I do find that the jury's verdict is unanimous. Ladies and gentlemen, this concludes your service in this case. I want to thank you again for your dedication and your hard oh, work so during this happy. trial. I know I speak for everybody here uh, when I appreciate, tell you that we appreciate your sacrifices and your time and your public service in this matter. Okay? So I'm going to have to go back to the jury deliberation room for one more uh, time and then we'll release you from there. Okay? All right. Thank you. That's the end. What do I do now? <laughs> for your professionalism and uh, you're welcome to come to my courtroom anytime well give me a few weeks but then you can come <laughs> any, anytime okay all right the court is adjourned thank, thank you. you that's the end i will say that this has been a six-year journey and this is the best possible outcome in the world and i'm just shocked that it went this well after what happened in london <laughs> i'm just absolutely absolutely shocked. I think there was only one thing that he lost on and the reason he lost on it was because it's impossible for them to prove. Oh, they're all hugging. Oh, that's sweet. But it's impossible for um, them to prove that Amber actually roughed the place up before the police came. So I think that's why they ruled in favor of Amber. But besides that, like, they're so happy. <laughs> I'm so happy. I'm like, it's over. I don't know what to do with myself now. Oh my god. Is Camille crying?
I can't tell. The message it sends to victims, particularly men, and how much easier it's going to be for them to come forward and think that they will actually be believed now is, um, it's incredible. And Johnny did that. And I think that's really what this is all about in the end.